Okay, y'all, so I'm about to try to put this wig on. These some super raggedy braids I already have, but you know, I'm not too worried about them. I'm not finna redo it. I'm just gonna brush this back like this. Wham, bam, thank you, man. And boom. There we go. So I'm going to pin them around. Like my hair kind of long, so I like to just tuck it down. Y'all, revelation. Did anybody know that you're supposed to put the bobby pin, like the ridge part on the inside of your hair, literally for the last 24 years? 24 years, I'm 26. <laughs> for the last 26 years I've been alive, I never put the bobby pin on that way. Ever. I always put it on the opposite way. So I'm just like, I don't know where I saw it. But I'm basically like, what have I been doing for my whole life? There we go. So I did bleach these knots, but sorry. I really try not to use wig caps because I just feel like they just ruin all my all of my shit I got going on. Like I feel like they slide back. I don't want to do a photo. What am I talking about? I don't want to do like melt the thing down to my head because I just don't want to keep no wig on my head. So I don't want to glue a whole wig cap to my to my forehead every day or just in general. So I did bleach the knots as you can see, but I'm going to put some foundation on it just so. Well, actually, I have this Sally Hansen spray. Where is it? I got this Sally Hansen spray. It is the airbrush leg medium glow. It's focusing. I'm gonna spray this on here, then hit it with the blow dryer. Just so it dry quicker. Because I think it works better than foundation. Let's see how I go. Like look. And you can like build up the color. I got some on the hair though. Y'all see it? it? Looks so much better, right? Am I the only one who like never cuts the lace off the back of my wig? <laughs> I literally never cut the lace off the back. I like how it has the combs right here on the edge. Unless you put, I can't think of no damn words today. Unless you put elastic band, like you sew your elastic band on, sometimes it's hard for it to come down, like especially if it's already made, it's too small. So, yeah, this how looking so far. These curls are legit perfection. I feel like it looks okay. Like I don't think I need a wig cap. What y'all think? Okay, so we about to put we about to cut this lace. I think this looks pretty good. This, these curls are lit, lit, lit. I think that's gonna be good. I think the lace is like just too, a little too dark. I got the darkest one. They didn't have the like, the color under this one, but I think this one is like slightly too dark for me. It looks like, I mean, it looks okay on camera, but in person it looks like it's just a little bit too dark.
Oh yeah, that's freaking cute. Yes. I feel like I have too much lace right here. I should cut it off. Like this little piece of lace right here. You need to go. I feel like it's too much, girl. It's too much and it's too dark. So that's awesome. Okay, so this is the finished look. I think it's super summery, super cute. I don't think I've ever done a style like this. So this is definitely something different for me, but I do really like it. So yeah, I really do like this. This hair is lit. Like this is like the perfect summer curl for your girl. So yeah, I really like this style. I think I want to do it again, but like, what if I did this style with like some color? I feel like this would look lit if it was red. If this was red, y'all wouldn't be able to tell me shit. Sh like, y'all wouldn't be able to tell me nothing. But just remember that all the links to this hair will be down below in the description box. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe.